wheels on the bus go round and round. This mom is upset with great clips in West Kelowna after she was refused service when she took her son Barrett in for his first haircut. Three women working asked uh, who the haircut was for. I said it was for my son. Um, they asked me if I had a mask for him. Um, I responded that he was under a year old and uh, they said he needed to be wearing a mask to be in the business. Children under the age of two are not required by law to wear masks. In fact, it's not recommended. It's a safety hazard that could lead to choking, suffocation, and cause them to touch their face more, increasing the risk of COVID-19 transmission. I uh, was very much looking forward to it. putting his lock of hair in his baby book, and uh, it was very confrontational and uh, very negative and really put a damper on the whole experience. I don't even think they said sorry. I've tried to contact the owner, contacted head office, and um, my calls have not been returned. Employers have a duty to accommodate customers and workers who are unable to wear a mask for medical reasons. At the same time, private businesses have the right to refuse to serve anyone who is not wearing a mask. We are erring on the side of caution so that uh, we can keep our stylists and our customers safe from any possible spread of COVID. The labor standards in BC are very clear that people do not have to do something they don't feel comfortable in doing, especially something where it can't be social distance. Sarah says she hopes this Great Clips location will just stop serving children under the age of two. I think that would be respected by all parents, but to allow children under the age of two in and force them to wear masks is very unsafe. As for Barrett, another salon was able to give him a fresh new look. For Castanet News, I'm Amanda Lina Letario.